Sorry I'm late. Did you forget to set your alarm clock? and welcome back to My Nerdy Home. My name is Stephanie. Thank you so much for watching this video. Another day, another trailer. Zack Snyder is keeping up the hype for Zack Snyder's Justice League and I am loving all of the marketing material. As I have said before, today he has put out a cyborg trailer. And before we get into the trailer, talking about the trailer as well as the poster, uh, I just want to remind everybody that there is a stream coming up, a very important stream. It is going to be held on Uche Wineri's channel alongside a bunch of Snyder Cut fans who are part of the Geeks and Gamers team and Zack Snyder is going to be a part of it. This stream is meant to celebrate Zack Snyder's Justice League but also to raise awareness and money for the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. I will have that stream linked in the description box below. Head on over there, set your reminders. If you can donate that would be amazing but if you cannot simply share the stream, get the word out there, let everybody know that this stream is going to be happening. This stream is going to be held the day before the the Snyder Cut releases on HBO Max. I really hope you guys head over there, set your reminders, and watch the stream when it comes out. Okay, with that being said, let's move on to the trailer and let's move on to the poster. Now, Zack Snyder has said in the past that Cyborg is the heart of this movie. Cyborg is his favorite member of the Justice League, so I'm not surprised that he saved Cyborg till the end. In regards to the marketing of each individual League member and their own individual teaser trailers. Cyborg in the theatrically released Justice League movie wasn't really utilized very well. We didn't get to know too much about him, but in this movie, we are going to see Cyborg's backstory. We're going to see him as he was before he became Cyborg, and I'm really looking forward to that. We will hopefully see what kind of relationship he had with his father before his father created him, used the mother box to create him. All right, now here's the poster for Cyborg. Just like every single poster that has come before it, it is in black and white. He has his symbol behind him and Ray Fisher looks amazing. This is definitely better than what we received before, than what we received in the theatrically released Justice League. In this poster right here in the center, there's a glowing light that shines brighter than anything else on his body and I feel like that's there. Not just because yes, he is a cyborg, but because he's the heart of the movie. I really feel like that is being displayed here in this poster. Now, Ray Fisher, of course, filmed this in a motion capture suit and the only thing that we can see from Ray Fisher is his face. So I'm looking forward to seeing a lot more of Ray Fisher as an actual person in the flashbacks leading up to his creation. All right, let's move on to Cyborg's trailer. Zach did put this up on Vero before it was up on Twitter, so that's where I am watching it from this morning. God, I'm so excited for this trailer. Uh, we're gonna see a lot more Cyborg in this movie. Okay, <laughs> let's get started. <laughs> Whatever happened to you, you have gifts now. Everything breaks for you. I can't wait to see what you can pick up. The world of ones and zeros oh, and are the wow. absolute masters. These boxes will get inside you and find your weaknesses and your fears. Take your place among the brave ones. Oh, man! I'm not broken. Oh, wow! And I'm not alone. I am looking forward to this movie. I'm super hyped for this movie. This right here, every single thing in this teaser trailer is brand new. It's nothing, nothing. There's nothing here that we've seen before. All of this is new footage. Now, at the beginning of the trailer, it looks like he is looking at some different archive footage of military weapons. Not too sure what he's looking at there. But the next shot, in the world of ones and zeros, you are the absolute master. That is, that's an awesome line. That is an awesome line. And also, I believe that's Diana, who is telling Cyborg that these boxes, meaning the mother boxes, will get inside of you and find your weaknesses and your fears during that part. It looks like Cyborg is in some sort of dream sequence where he is not Cyborg. He is normal. He is like he used to be and he's turning around looking at his parents and then the camera pans and he is Cyborg again. Afterwards, we hear the words, take your place among the brave ones. And then we get a freaking hero shot. This is a hero shot of Cyborg. He is powering up and then he just shoots into the sky, total face cover, embracing what he has become. I am looking forward to this movie. I hope everybody is looking forward to this movie. I hope everybody is going to watch this movie when it premieres on HBO Max. This marketing has been unbelievable and I'm so excited 
for Zack Snyder's Justice League. So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Please come and say hi on Instagram and Twitter. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and feel free to share it around if you like. Also, I hope you'll consider subscribing and let me know in those comments down below what kind of videos you'd like to see in the future. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone.